Hi everyone and welcome back to another part of the dating games. Um, what's his name? Shane? <laughs> I forgot his name already. Shane is in bed at the minute but he will be getting up rather soon and uh, Karen was actually rocking in that chair over there. I'm just in the rain, you know. Why? Is there certain things not loaded? I don't know. Not got a clue, that was weird. But I have a few ideas. This rain's really gloom and loud. I do not like... I don't like the rain. I'm sorry. But that's really annoying. Okay. Anyways, there's I've been a few ideas. A lot of you wanted to do killing them off and a lot of you didn't. And I've been thinking about it. And although killing them off would be fun, I really do like the idea of the reunion at the end. Um, oh, oh, they're attracted to each other. Um, yeah, so I really like the idea of the reunion in the end. So what I was thinking of doing, he's still in bed, still in bed. Um, I was thinking of building a basement. Um, I'm not really sure where I would, but I could just pop some ladders down, I don't know, here or something and have a basement. But uh, I thought that would be fun and that um, when someone uh, loses or when it's time to eliminate someone, we'll just put them into the basement. Sorry, this rain's doing my head and I'm going to turn it off. I am going to turn the rain off because it's so dang loud. So freaking loud. Let's just turn all weathers off because we don't even need the weather. And let's just have summer. Why not? <laughs> Why not? Um, it's bothering me. <laughs> right, where was I? Yeah, every time someone gets eliminated, um, we'll pop them down into the basement. And that way we could keep an eye on relationships and things down in the basement. See if they kind of keep arguing. Um, you know, kind of like uh, Big Brother. Not Big Brother in the UK, but Big Brother in America. Because I have watched that one quite a few times. And I actually prefer it to the UK one. But uh, they all go to the house. Well, not all of them, but after a certain point, they start going to a different house to stay at. So it'll be kind of like that, but here, but from the beginning. Yeah, that made sense. Probably not, but I know what I'm talking about, and I hope you guys do too. So, I'm sorry if my voice is a little bit weird today. Um, I'm pretty much just up, and it's kind of early. Is there an elevator here? Is there? What is that? What is this? What is that? Where? I don't know what that is. Oh, it's from the hot tub. Okay. Right, so Shane's just getting up and we're going to go ahead and have him serve up some waffles. Some of you were saying we should get a butler and things. I kind of like the fact that they have to cook by themselves. I think that's pretty fun. Um, instead of having someone do it for us. Oh, this is what his um, <laughs> his sleepwear is like. These like boxers with the love hearts on. I thought that, that was really fun. But yeah, in this part, we're going to have our first competition. So we'll just get him ready for that by having breakfast. And uh, I really want someone else to clean that up. I really do. But I'm not allowed to make them clean it. Oh, we've got these hot dogs here as well, which need cleaned. Yeah, that's a bit of a pain. Right, let's see. Oops, let's see what everyone else is doing. So, Rosetta is over here watching TV with Karen. Karen is a firm favourite from a lot of you. She really is. Um, Haley is still asleep. <laughs> as is her twin sister. Yep, as is her twin sister. Dorothy is about to go and flatter. About to go and flatter Abby here, who is in the hot tub yet again, naked. Why is she always in the hot tub naked? I don't know. I don't know. But I guess that's just what she likes to do. Julianne's still asleep. And yep, they're asleep. So let's go ahead and watch her flatter then. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. What's going on? Come on. Come on. I'm sorry, I'm really bad with camera angles. Okay, what are you doing now? Listen, what, what are you making her listen to? Talk about cameras. I'm sure that's very interesting. Oh! 
Oh. You're not supposed oh. to do that. Oh. You're not supposed, but he's chose to do that without me telling him. So should I let him do that? It's usually, oh, it's cancelled itself anyway. And uh, <laughs> she's like, oh, you're not getting there before me. Um, so Julianne here is about to gossip with uh, Shane. Did Shane even make those dang waffles? Yes, he did, but he didn't eat them. You're so smart, Shane. You are so smart. Right, let's see. Oh, all these walls just keep getting in my way. That's one thing I don't really like about the house. Oh, and then he's got Be Thanked and a Shaka Bra. Oh, they're all getting to come and talk to him now. So, I think she'll be thanking him for the food. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. And now he's going to be Shaka Brad by... Uh, Colleen here. I'm still forgetting the names. I'm still forgetting the names, but we'll get there. <laughs> Where is Colleen? There, she's coming now. Because I don't really want to do anything and cancel that because it was her that decided to do that. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. Right, so. What? Oh, so I guess they're chatting now, but I think that was him that started that one. Um... Should I let that happen? Yeah, it was him that started that one, so it's okay to cancel that one. So we'll go ahead and grab a plate of our waffles here. No, I'm not going to have him try and interact with them at all. Only let the girls decide that they want to interact. Yeah, I think that's a good plan. And this place is so dirty. Maybe we should hire a maid. <laughs> But it's kind of fun seeing all the dirt. Let's see what's going on here. What are you doing? Clean. Oh, you're doing a bit of cleaning, Julianne. How nice. How nice. And I'm sorry, but you're not going to get a job. And well, after he's had something to eat, um, he will go ahead and um, we'll start the... Actually, yeah. Where am I going to put that? I have a plan for our first challenge, so... <laughs> Oh, Abby here is in the, in the, in here, and she isn't, she isn't, uh, streaking, or, what's it called? I can't remember, skinny dipping? <laughs> she isn't doing that. So let's go ahead and turn that off. Um, you, what are you going to, oh, oh, you, she was about to go and start a water balloon fight, but, oh, <gasps> Oof! They're all they're all trying to talk to him now. <laughs> right. We need to find a place to put the thing for the competition to see what's going to be going on a date. We do. And let me just get rid of all this. I don't know where. I don't know where it would be. It's the little um, what are they called? Like um, bull things that like. Oh my god! The thing oh gee we don't need to hear you meow i don't know if you guys heard that you know the things <sighs> oh gosh where is it where is it the things that you could like buck the bull thing i know exactly what i'm trying to say but i don't freaking see it let's see parties maybe nope Sporting Buck and Chuck Bronco. <laughs> right, so we'll pop that there. And we're going to just go ahead and see who can last on here the longest. I've got my little notepad. And what I'm actually going to go ahead and do is I'm going to turn off. Actually, he's got a few girls wanting to talk to him. So um, we'll, we'll let that happen before we start. What are you what are you saying, Tom Julianne? Talk about the hail. How interesting. And what are you wanting to do? Complain about dirty dishes. <laughs> I don't know if he'll like that. I don't know. I don't think he will. Are you about to do it though? Oh, there she's coming. There she's because it's up to them what they want to say to him, so okay. Oh, he did. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. So, we isn't really doing anything at the minute. I think we'll start. We'll start at the bottom with Karen and work our way up. So, Karen, get out here and do the 
Um, we'll do crazy cowgirl for them all, I think. Get off. Let's see. Because none of them have any... Why you still got a wand? I don't want you to have a wand. <laughs> Let's get rid of that. Uh, none of them have any skills, I don't believe. Because, yeah, we haven't gave them any skills. So, yay! Let's see how she does. Oh, gosh. She's doing pretty good. Way to write the name Karen down on my little notepad. How long is this going to last? She's doing it super good. Super, super good. And what's her mood like as well? Oh! Oh, Julianne's coming to check out the competition. Oh. <laughs> and, oh, she's away to complain about dirty dishes with him. What are you doing? Oh, she was be he was being asked to water balloon fight there. Okay, how about you come here and watch this because I don't want you interacting with any of the girls. I mean, not oh, there we go, she's off. She's off. And I thought we would get a notification to see how long she lasted. Okay then. I'm gonna say that was about... I'm gonna say she lasted a good... I don't know what time it was when she started though. Should we have her do that again? I feel I feel bad if I do it again and she lasts like nowhere near the same amount of time. I was sure it like gave you a notification. <laughs> right, we'll do this girl here first. So go into Colleen, crazy cowgirl. All right. Oh, oh, Karen, what are you doing? Get to know. Are you coming? Are you coming? Oh my goodness. Right. Ugh. Hurry up. She just needs to use the toilet and then she'll be here. But Karen's getting to know Shane, which is good. How is it? Yeah. Uh, Karen and Colleen are in the lead by the looks of things, although. Yep. And Abby is a last. Oh, Abby. Alright, are you about... Yeah, she's coming now. What we'll do is I'll pay attention to the time that they start on the, like, clock thing. If she ever appears to do the damn challenge. <laughs> right. So it's 58. Ah, uh, right, Colleen. Uh, will I write that name down? Right, so it's 58. Oh, and it's at 24. Okay. It was 24. I definitely seen it say 24. So, um, 58 to 24 would be 24, 26. 26 is what she gets. Next, you are going to go ahead and do Crazy Cowgirl. I'm actually pretty sure that Karen did last longer than that though. I don't know. I'm pretty sure Karen did. I am pretty dang sure. Oh, come on, hurry up. Get over here. What are you doing? I hope you're not like... Okay, he's having a bath. Oh, that was 49 that she started, I'm pretty sure. So... She's at 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, I'm scared to like put it on speed three in case I mess up. So I felt like I almost messed up with Colleen. I did. I really did. Okay. Hmm. I did say crazy cowgirl. Oh, and there she's off. So it was 49 until 25. So. Oh, I'm trying to imagine a clock now. <laughs> right, so what was her name? Julie Ann. 
that's what, 49, 59. So 29 would have been 30. So I'm so bad at math. <laughs> like 79. So I'm pretty sure she was like 20. Oh my gosh. 49. 25. Oh my god, what is wrong with me? It's too early in the freaking morning. 49 to. There is 49. Uh, 11 plus 25 is 36. Jesus, that took way too long. <laughs> Gosh. Right, get out of the hot tub, you. And come. Okay. Right. Holly. Right, and then can you. Crazy cowgirl, please. That would be awesome. Come on. Right. So, 52. She started up. Uh, what are you doing, Shane? Oh, listening to her. Oh my goodness. She doesn't like... Okay, and she got 708, so that was... Oh, 52, 702, 9, yep, that was 17 for her. So Abby is 17. I hope I'm doing all this right. <laughs> yeah, it was, right? Yeah, yeah. There's no way it wasn't right. Okay. Okay. Come and do Crazy Cowgirl Dorothy. That'd be great. Shane, what are you doing? Oh gosh, they're all trying to speak with them now. <laughs> right, Dorothy. So let me write her name down. Okay. Are you actually taking this long to get here? Come on. Come on. There we go. Right, so she was 49. 49. That was rubbish. 49 until 56. So, yeah, that was only 7, Dorothy. That was only 7. Dorothy's completely out. Haley. Uh, let me write her name down. Go ahead and get over here. And do the crazy cowgirl. Come on. And Colleen just took a skinny dip in the pool. Colleen. Oh gosh. There, there's this going down. Right. 8.21 for Colleen. Or is this Haley? Yeah. Haley. 8.21. Okay, come on. Okay, and she got to 39, so 21, 31, so that was 18. All right, and then we've got, we've got Rosetta. We need to stop sleeping. <laughs> what are you doing sleeping, Rosetta? Right, okay. And then she needs to come along and uh, crazy cowgirl. Yeah! All right. Come on. So, in first place at the moment is Julianne. Julianne. Although, I'm pretty sure... I still think Karen was on there the longest. I do. She seems to be on there forever. She did. She really did. Oh, what's this? Listen to complain. <laughs> okay, so she was 34. Oh, okay, that was mm, that wasn't even ten. So that was thirty-four until forty-two. So that was eight. Yep, that was only eight for what's your name again, Rosetta? Which is still better than uh, Dorothy did. So you're not last place. So it's just Karen that's. Uh, we'll get Karen to do it again. Ugh. But I am pretty sure Karen's was the longest. 
So it's actually between Karen and um, it's between Karen and Julianne at the minute. What's this? A lesson? Okay. Oh, what's going on? Oh gosh. Okay. Come on. Come on. What now? Listen. What is up with her? And it's about new house. Okay. Are you? Oh, she wanted to react to the skinny dipper. Are you coming along or what? Right. So that was twenty-eight. Okay. But she did last on there. It seemed to be forever. I'll double check it in the recording, but uh, yeah, she did. Oh, so that was 28 until 47, so 38, for, so that was only 19, but that was nowhere near as long as our first one. Our first one, I felt anyway, went on for ages, but uh, since we didn't count it, what I think we'll actually do is because I do feel like Karen's first one was a lot longer. I'll double check it in the recording, but uh, I think we might actually, I think, well, we'll do this, it this way and have Julianne be the one going on the date tomorrow, but if I look back at the recording and uh, Karen actually did get longer the first time round, then uh, she will be the one that will also get a date. So yeah. What's this? Respond to question. What on earth is going on, guys? <laughs> what question are you responding to? They're like all in his bedroom, just like chatting. <laughs> okay. Shaka bra. Oh gosh. Why does she always want to do the shaka bra with him? He is. Oh, wait, no. It's because that's her sister. I was like. What? It's actually Julianne that's uh, got to know him the most so far, though. Right. Oh, Dorothy's coming up here as well. Dorothy's coming up to chat. And... Oh, what a shame! She was, like, wanting to shack a brat, and then Dorothy's like, no. I I'm the one here. I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm getting in here. <coughs> right. Okay, well what we'll do is we'll have them go ahead and go to sleep. Oh, we'll have him go ahead and go to sleep anyway. I think I actually just cancelled that by accident. <laughs> Gosh. I should have let that play out, but never mind. Right, so what's Julianne up to? She's in bed, obviously getting plenty of sleep before her big date tomorrow. And I need to actually go ahead and remove that um, bucking thing. Where did it go? Oh, it is here. I was like, what? What is going on? Yeah. So what's everyone else up to? Rosetta is going to rock in the chair. Because, you know, why not? Haley's in bed. Dorothy's in bed. Abby is in bed. Julianne's in bed. Colleen's in bed. And uh, Karen's getting some... Uh, salad. Where is she? Where is Karen? Oh, she's just sitting outside enjoying her, s oh, and choking on her salad. <laughs> right. She really need to go to bed, Karen. You do. You really do. Yeah. I don't know whether we should do the person that done the worst in that challenge there should be eliminated, so that would be um, Dorothy that done the worst or we'll do a different elim elimination um, I think we'll do different uh, date competitions and different elimination competitions that way I feel like it's a little bit more fair a little bit uh, is that, was that her finally getting up? nope she's going back into the rocking chair she's like I'm just going to rock outside your window um, don't mind me you know just while you sleep <laughs> Right, when he gets up, we could go ahead and have him use the toilet, have a shower. What just broke? Oh, okay, well, what we'll do is we'll actually have him unclog the toilet, then use the toilet, then shower. 
And I'm not too fast for the food today because we're going on the date, which is always a good thing. Right, you could just get up. Just get up. How's Julianne? Julianne's pretty good. And what's the question she's responding to? Ask about dating. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Right. We're, I'm not actually going to have them interact all that much on this date. I think we'll just have them go to a movie and go get some food, you know, that sort of stuff. The toilet's broken though. Didn't I tell you to unclog it? I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure I asked you to unclog the toilet. Come on. Okay, you must be too hungry. Right, well, what we're gonna do is where's Julianne? Julianne's over here. Apparently, yeah. Okay. Oh, she's he's listening to her. What, what are you wanting? Share a secret. Okay, well, Julianne's talking anyway, so. What are you doing? Chat. I'm chatting now. Okay. Alright, well. We'll just let that go ahead. There we go. Right. Julianne. Romantic and, uh. We'll go ahead and flirt with her. Can we. Can Abby, please just use the other toilet. <laughs> What I actually think I might do is after this uh, date, instead of doing competitions to eliminate them, just whoever hasn't gained the most relationship with him, I think will be the one that's eliminated. Because, I mean, they have all been trying, right? They've all been trying to... Um, uh, can we just form a group, please? What is this? No! Just use the other dang toilet. Look, there's freaking toilet over there that nobody's even standing in that room but no you have to show us to the other room okay so we'll form a group gosh walls everywhere in this dang house really pretty annoying to be honest okay so we're in a group now um hanging out sounds fun okay so, we'll go ahead and uh, blow her a kiss. If I could get an angle, like, away from all these dang walls, that would be great and much appreciated. <laughs> so let's go ahead and blow her a kiss. <laughs> She's so excited. <laughs> her face. Her eyes are so freaking big. Right, so that's them on a date now. Looks like it's just Shane and Julianne now. Right, so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and have them go for some breakfast. So we'll just have them go out to... Where could we go to eat? Where could we go to eat? We could just go here. And uh, eat here. Eat here with date. Yep, yeah, that sounds like a good idea. You could do that. Oh. Let's go. Julianne, on you go. On you go, Julianne. What are you doing? Oh, we had to wait until she came up the stairs. I was like, what on earth is going on right now? Okay, so we're no longer going to eat. So I have to tell them to do that again. That's stupid. Where was it? Where was the dang place? I don't remember where it was. Seriously? Why don't I see it? Oh. It's right here. I'm blind. Can't see a thing. Right, let's go. You said both better be going. There's one, there's two, and they're both getting into the car. Awesome. Awesome. I want to zoom in there. Can I, Can you not? Can you please let me zoom in? <laughs> Jeez Louise. Alright, so they're going to this cute little diner for something to eat. Yay. Let's see. We'll watch their relationship. Their relationship's pretty good. He's the only one that she is... He's the... She's the only one that he's actually friends with from them all, so... Yeah, Karen's actually next after her. So once they've done that, I think we'll actually 
we won't bother with a movie because we'll have to wait until about five I believe let me double check yeah next show's at five so we'll just tour the theater with our date that will be just as fun I'm sure so Julian Sweets just ate at a restaurant and so did Shane so they're just gonna go ahead and shake the and uh, thingy the theater and then maybe after the theater we'll have a little little bit of flirt and nothing too much nothing too much all right let's see what else everybody else is doing. she's in bed she's asking about her day she's using the toilet she's responding about the day oh she's obviously at the theater she's uh she's just swimming about whoopsie and uh she's just relaxing so yeah We'll just go ahead and speed through all this and zoom in a bit. Yeah. What is this? Can we turn that on? Why not? Oh, that's them done. Alright, so what I think we'll actually go ahead and do. They are now good friends. So I actually have him go ahead and give her some perfect purple flowers, you know, since she done such a good job on the date. Sweet. Oh. Alright. And then we'll actually go ahead and give her um, a heat of the moment kiss. See if she accepts that. And she does! Awesome! Okay. Yay! So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and um, can we just end the date now? That's what I want to do. Okay, let's just go ahead and uh, take a romantic photo together. Oh, she was about to give us a massage. Whoopsie. I hate when you do interactions at the same time and it uh, cancels the one beforehand. So we'll take a romantic photo together to put up in our wall because this is obviously our first date. They're quite cute together actually. And uh, yeah. We'll go ahead and end the date here. So ask to leave dates. Hopefully they had a good time. Because we don't want to work too much and get all the way up on the first. It's pretty much all the way up anyways. So yeah, so that was fun. So we'll have him go ahead and go home. And we'll get that photo put up into his bedroom. Because that's obviously been the first date of the games so we should do that um right let's see where am i where am i oh okay i need to get the photo from here i was like wait where's the photo camera photos um view photos and i want to take that and put it up on the wall just here is fine Yay, so that's a picture from their first um, date. It's quite a cute picture. Yeah. Oh, what's going on now? Be asked to water balloon fight. Okay then. Okay then. Yay. I'm surprised there's like no one been arguing with each other or, you know anything like that can we just water balloon fight instead of having to walk all the freaking way over here that would be great <laughs> i am so freaking impatient it's unbelievable there we go Oracle. oh i guess she just changed her mind oh it's because karen come it's along and she's like, no, stop water balloon fighting. I want to shack a bra you. <laughs> Seriously. Poor freaking Haley. Poor, poor Haley. I feel bad for her now. <laughs> I really do. Oh, and Dorothy's just cancelled that one because she wants to chat with him. Oh, Alright, well, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Dorothy's like, no. I'm jumping in here now. I want to chat with you. What's this? She's had a boring conversation. Is any of them like not like each other? Really? Oh, she's friends with uh, Colleen though. Like, they, they seem to be the only ones 
that I've made friends, really. Whoopsie, didn't want to do that. Yep. So they're gonna chat. Why not, right? Okay, cool. Oh, and uh, she's gonna ask him about the show. <laughs> okay, cool, that's fine. And she wants to kiss Shane. Okay. So Julianne's getting all in the way of Dorothy here. She's like, no. Oh. Oh gosh. Right. You know what? Let's just go ahead and see what needs you have right now. We need to use the toilet. So we could go ahead and do that. We could go ahead and do that. I think what we'll do is we'll actually, someone suggested um, making it the first uh, four that get the green bar. That'll be the finalists. So that's a good idea, right? Right? Because the top four right now is Julianne, Haley, Karen and Rosetta. Those are the top four at the second. So you could just unclog that and then we'll have them um, actually. What else does he need? He needs a toilet. And then I suppose he could just go ahead and go to bed. Although it's kind of early. Kind of early. What are they all doing? She's having a salad. She's relaxing in the hot tub. She's also relaxing in the top tub. They're chatting with one another. Uh, she's preparing hot dogs. Mmm. Delicious. We'll actually go ahead and <clears throat> have him go wait for some hot dogs. So we'll just have him kind of chill out and watch a little bit of TV. Are, are they both like skinny dipping in the pool? How about we go ahead and skinny dip in the pool as well? Or will that ruin the girly moment right here? <laughs> Let's go ahead and see. Oh, I really want to like hide the cloves that would be so funny that would be so freaking funny <laughs> so they're like just having a blast skinny dipping <laughs> all right oh she got hungry let's actually get out and we're gonna go ahead and hide oh what we'll do is we'll hide Dorothy's cloves I think I really want to. I really want to. Just hide the clothes. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. <laughs> He's like, hid the clothes. That's funny. That is funny. Is, is the hot dogs being made yet? Because I really think we should have some hot dogs. Let's not rock and let's go ahead and grab a plate of hot dogs. Dorothy, when are you going to get out of the pool, honey? When are you going to get out of this pool? <laughs> I just want to see Dorothy get out of the pool. I really do. Can I like... Oh, what's this? Ooh, bubbles! I really want to have her get out of the pool. I really do. Do you think I should? Oh, gosh. She's bound to get out soon. I mean, she's hungry, right? I'm not meant to control them, so I don't really... Oh, he's away to bed. But I think we'll just sit and watch Dorothy until she uh, decides to get out of the pool. Oh, here we go. I want to, like, face her so I can see what she's going to do. Oh, she doesn't seem to care. She's like, who cares? Someone, someone got my clothes? Okay, well, I just have to use this towel then. She, like, actually celebrated the fact that somebody stole her freaking clothes and she's just like well screw it I'll just use that <laughs> looks like Dorothy has been pranked she needs to take a shower or use the dresser to get some clothes <laughs> well she didn't seem to care that was disappointing very freaking disappointing to be honest whatever <laughs> what's everyone else up to a lot of people are making their way to bed Yep, and Karen's just chilling out here on the rocking chair. 
So what I think we'll do is we will go ahead and end this part here. I hope you all enjoyed this part and I will speak to you all soon. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and all that stuff. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.